Le pain. Ben, how are you feeling? See, his strat is to do the first lap fast and the second lap fast. <laughs> Racing on the weekend, mate. Thanks. So good. Are you recovered now or? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> My mother made me go to the training yesterday morning. I was like, not happening. <laughs> I'm still so sore. Just cruise it. Yeah. Like, solid pace there. Yeah. So faster than me and Trent. I don't know if I'll fully grind, but I kind of yeah. will, but I kind of don't. So. Right. Is that this race? Yeah. Thanks, bro. Might go like. Can you guys be running together. <laughs> Might go like yeah. four ish first game. Okay. Four, four. Tactical, yeah. Then if I can, maybe push it a bit. Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't know. Are you, are you running with that? Uh, probably. Recent. This today. Is really? today. Yeah, I've seen it. The pants, like, it's... they're actually all right. Okay, okay. They like, like, feel a lot better than the bloody thick ones. Can you? Yeah. What's going That's on, bro? Well, Mr. Lamex. Not you. you. Boys, you the... How you doing? Pretty good, Pretty good, thanks. We finished senior in 1985, and in those years, cross country was, had a very strong culture at the school. It was a very key part of the school. And the boys tried really, really hard to win GPS cross country for many years many years we got close so many times probably be gps cross country in grade 11 where i came in top five when i started in year eight there was maybe 15 Nine boys and by the time i graduated we were close to 60 to 80 and it was just so much fun having the team grow as i went through school favorite memory was probably always just winning cross country as a team just the atmosphere after they announced that we win is always such a great feeling my best achievement was in 2014 winning QG Triple SA Cross Country for the third year in a row. My funniest achievements with Cross Country was when we won after Girls Grammar had 21 years in a row, or they were trying to get 21 years in a row. Before they even won, they had a lunchbox saying 21 is fun or 21 is great, and they had bike pants and a water bottle, and we ended up taking it off them. So they had to throw them all in the bin. So can't say I was upset about that. <laughs> the level of coaching is probably the biggest thing that changed through my five years. In year eight, we had a not a, an enthusiastic teacher who took cross country, but by the time Mr Langmack arrived and we actually got some proper training programs and training sessions, the boys improved dramatically. You can see the buggy all the way over on the far side. Oh, you've got to get the proper one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's just yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think you guys are any match for my 10k mileage for the week. Uh, last week I did 12 actually. Oh, really? Oh. You're ahead of me. No, I haven't had a chance to test them out yet. Yeah. Goes well with the quads. Definitely the worst decision to wear this. Someone turn off the weather. I miss being fit. Yes, I wonder how Jasper's are. His bikes are holding up here. Definitely the worst decision. So much uni work to do. I know. We're going to submit an assignment tonight. Oh, really? I'm going to have a presentation on Tuesday. Really? I'm also but us that all. Yeah. It's good. Yes, sir. Good time, mate. Good form. 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 Good form.
Oh, low key feeling it. Really? Nah, <laughs> kind of. We have to yeah. catch the group. Easy, we can catch them. Yes. Okay. I'm just thirsty. That's you, buddy. Ooh. 200 meters to go. Come on, Trent. Wait, do we have another lap? Yeah. Right, are you serious? We have another lap. Yep. What? Yep. I, th I legit thought that was the end. Roughly four minutes. I'm sore. We, we couldn't. Like, hey, we were looking behind at you guys. Uh, <laughs> we like around that little middle bit. So you guys were like, yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. I was like, ooh. Yeah. Surging and then falling down. Yeah. <laughs> that course is hard. <laughs> I'm going to die. <laughs> <laughs> That's the hardest run of my life. <laughs> it was good though. Yeah. Thank you. I am actually a professional triathlete. So still doing quite a lot of running. But I've added in some swimming and cycling as well. I could never deal with the fast starts of cross country. I needed about an hour's warm up before we ended up starting. I'm going to America in August. I'm going to Northern Arizona University for cross country athletics. I'm studying sonography at CQ University. And then GPS cross country was always held out at Nudgy where we were envious of their grounds, but we loved going out there and giving them a beating when we only had one over. So one. Mm -hmm. Me, you finish that. That was the worst thing I could have done. Every one of your friends is going to see this. <laughs> mm -hmm. Nice. What do you think? Well, Should I grab another sausage? I don't know. Yeah, mate, do it. Uni today. Yeah, I decided to skip it. <laughs> I was like, nope. Well done. I thought you won the 3,000 metres Australian titles. We're cheering for you like all shit. So suddenly we realised it was only the bloody Renegades race. Yeah, no, I was not going to win that race. So. <laughs> I learned never to <laughs> run in Victory 3s. Victory 3s are an amazing running spike. I've run many cross country races in them, Jasper. I'll give you an in-depth review. All right. So, I believe they're called Russian cakes. It tastes like sugar in a brick. Any students? <laughs> 